Hope you won. It's Be Divine and welcome to Divine Miracles channel and the tarot mini forecast this week for the water signs and I am using the ancient Egyptian tarot this week. Um, see what comes through. I found this in all my things um, so I'm really pleased with that one being back. And let's just see what messages we get this week. Hopefully you are happy and well wherever you are. I am back in Adelaide now so I am available um, once again in Adelaide for healings, readings, group sessions, workshops, whatever you like. Let's work something out and um, I'll work with you. So here we go. I'm going to start with um, Pisces and see what's coming through. I've had a lot of interesting cards already this week. So here we go. Pisces. Okay. Oh my goodness, we got this for another um, one of the other ones as well, the Prince of Cups for, for Pisces. So this is saying here that I feel that there may be some kind of um, influences around you at the moment that you felt have been quite negative actually. So the Prince of Cups in himself as, as a um, energy moving forward in your life is very positive. But I feel that you've had some very, very negative experiences going on, um, perhaps making you feel lower in energy uh, within yourself. Maybe you've been going back to some old habits or some old ways of doing things. Maybe some old people have come back into your life and they're influencing you in some way. Now this is saying to you that you have a way forward, obviously you know that there's a way out of things um, and things are going to start looking up again for you. Um, the pain will be released as well, um, but you have to stop self-sabotaging you know, your own success. Sometimes there are people in our life that come through and we make an enormous connection with them and then they seem to fade out. But sometimes people are just going on their journey a little bit. They're not faded out anywhere. You know, they're still there for you at any time. It's just that they're going through things and you're going through things. A good friend will always be there no matter what and no matter how much the distance is between. Um, you know, you might be the sort of person that um, if you haven't heard from someone, um, you, know, you know, once a week or twice a week or something, then you think something's wrong. Um, or you might be the sort of person that you could leave it yourself, you know, for a month or two and then get in contact with someone and, and pick up from there. But something has made you alter your view of a situation, maybe of a person. Something has made you feel um, trapped in a circumstance. And this is saying to you that there is something happening. There's something in the wings already that is going to lift you out of that. Okay, you need to know that you are really deserving of the best in life and there's nothing holding you back other than your own, perhaps your own self-doubt or your own fears or your own insecurities and that's the same for anybody, you know, we've all got those, um, you know, I have plenty of them as well, but we work our way through them and, you know, you have a lot more confidence than you used to have within yourself and you're going to keep on growing with that. But don't let, if there's anything that's bothering you, say to yourself, if this is not my energy, then it needs to leave now, you know. Oftentimes I work with Archangel Michael to free me of any energy that's not my own. Because sometimes, you know, I start feeling annoyed for no reason or upset for no reason. And it's usually because I'm picking up on someone else. Okay, so maybe that's what's happening for you as well. So trust in yourself, believe in yourself, and wait because there's someone coming that will help you, okay? And uh, follow that, whatever makes you feel good within yourself. Okay, Pisces. So then we've got Cancer. Cancer, the Three of Wands. Okay, all right. I'm just having a good look at what this card is actually. Have a look here. The Three of Wands. Okay, so for Cancer, there is a more creative flow happening within you. There are things that are about to turn around to your advantage 
and you know you are going to see the results of all of your hard work I'm feeling here with this particular message for cancer that you want to do things on your own all the time and it wears you out you know there is a time for, for you to delegate some work to other people as well because the projects are getting bigger and bigger and bigger also be careful once again energetically of taking on too much energy from other people psychic attacks can happen all the time uh, we can pick we're picking up more and more energy now as we're absorbing a lot more as our abilities are beginning to open there are things from your past that you really need to let go of there are people from your past that you might need to forgive in your heart as well and sometimes you need to see that you're not um, always 100 percent right because uh, with how you felt about someone else or what their motives were sometimes um, it's because of this energy thing where someone else is feeding you information and you start taking it all on and then you start lashing out sometimes at the wrong people but this is saying here there's a breakthrough for you okay I'm also feeling there may be a house move job move there's some sort of movement happening and it's affecting the home and although it may feel like you're losing a lot you're actually going to gain a lot more if you follow through with things okay you um, need to really embrace who you are a little more um, and see that you are capable of so many things and if you want really really good things keep on holding on to that really really um, happy intention that you have in your heart and let go of anything that is not mirroring that feeling anything that's taking you away from that anything that's making you angry anything at all it's time to get rid of it okay so let go and release okay now Scorpio all right okay I'm just going to close my eyes and focus on Scorpio Scorpio the ace of coins okay there it is okay Scorpio well this is a very fortunate time okay and it feels to me that you've you've reached a, a point of um, abundance in your life and something else is about to start or something else is about to begin for you on a financial level I feel that for some of you you have so many ideas as well and uh, you'll get a little bit afraid because you're looking too far uh, ahead into the future about what will happen if I do that and if I do that then this person will get upset and you talk yourself out of it and that's something I, I know a little bit about myself um, you have to avoid that temptation to have one foot stuck into the future because that future can change every single day things are changing and shifting and growing the biggest thing that you can focus on is what's going to bring you the most happiness forget family forget lovers and partners and everything like that what brings you the most happiness because if you figure that part out then what will happen is that those around you are going to pick up on that so you focus on your happiness you start becoming happy you start feeling less stressed you start having less responsibilities and all of that and that is what other people will pick up on you know the family the kids whatever they'll start saying oh you know he's cool and he's happy so this is okay you know everything's stress-free but when you start going oh, I need to move I need to get a new place I need to get out of this job and I need to I need to do something else but it's never gonna happen because I've got this bill and I've got that bill that kind of thing or that we get ourselves into we know it doesn't get us anywhere because we're still doing that thing okay there is opportunities around you to make an extra income something that is more to your liking something that brings happiness on many levels something that's very healing for you and other people as well and it's time now to start writing things down 
um, you know make a list of all the things you'd like to to do in your life and you know um, all the things you'd like to have happen and if you some people that are um, you know in the abundant phase and all that things oh I don't really need money but the more that you have the more you're able to give other people as well and you know the more knowledge that you share the more knowledge that you gain and you really have to teach in order to learn and it's time that all of your talents and abilities come out people are seeing them more and that you're not in the background anymore thinking that oh I just do this quietly and you know it's okay uh, because it's not okay anymore you need to you know share because there are so many people that could really value um, or, or get insight from what you've got to teach and teaching can just mean instructing or supervising um, you know guiding people it doesn't matter how in what capacity it is but that you're getting a voice to come out there is a lot of healing going on in the throat chakra for all of us and this is why we feel disconnected from our neck. <laughs> there's things going on up here, there's things going on in the middle body, and there's things going on in the lower body, and none of it's making any sense, okay? Because we're getting attuned to all these different energies and things. And this has just been going on, and we're just having to learn to deal with those um, things too. But abundance is coming to you, opportunity is coming to you, and you have the goods to have your own, um, you know, different free lifestyle. You have the goods already, you've learnt it through life. And it's now time to share that with other people. And you're getting these windows of opportunity now. And Scorpio, um, you're getting quite a lot of these opportunities, but only for a little while longer. Then things are not gonna be quite so ripe again. So use it while everything's working for you, you know. Um, use the energy to your advantage and start that process and you will reap the results of that. Don't doubt yourself anymore. That all has to leave. Um, after all, how can you help people to believe in themselves if sometimes you don't either, okay? So lift and remember that the universe will always show you a way forward as long as you're asking and also to, you know, going within to seek the answers as well, okay? So that is awesome news for um, Scorpio. You are definitely on to something. Keep on going and uh, the results will be there for you. Okay, um, just remember I am available on all social media at Divine Miracles. And also if you need something intensive or some mentoring or you wanna come up with something of your own, please let me know and I'll work with you towards something. Also, if you're interested in workshops in Melbourne, um, it, or in all the different states of Australia, uh, as well as Canada and the US, please let me know. Um, I'll be on the move every three months this year, so I'll be able to set up some things and away we go. So looking forward to hearing from you guys and until the next uh, video, it's goodbye for now. Bye.